Recently, Pokemon announced that Ash's story will be coming to an end. We'll have 11 episodes to see how he'll reach the impossible goal of Pokemon Master before Generation 9 gives us two brand new Pokemon trainers. <laughs> yeah. Like that's ever gonna happen. While this has upset quite a few people, leading some to decide they'll no longer watch the Pokemon anime, I see it more positively. How's it going everyone, Electro Pikachu here, and today, I'm going to talk about why Ash leaving the Pokemon anime is actually a good thing. To start off, let's talk about Ash's recent accomplishment. After one of the best Pokemon battles in the entire anime, Ash defeated Leon, taking his title as the strongest trainer in the world. With an accomplishment this major, one can only ask, where else is Ash supposed to go? Some Pokemon fans have tried to come up with ideas for things he can do. Maybe he can take on Paldea's Pokemon League, as there are multiple champion level trainers. Maybe he should seek out legendary Pokemon like Latias and Ho-Oh. Or maybe he should seek out something far more elusive than any legendary. His father. However, that then brings in another question. How will this lead him to grow as a trainer? If Ash is the world's strongest trainer, it makes it more difficult for him to reasonably lose a battle. People already have problems with Ash losing certain battles up to this point, so if Pokemon were to make him lose to a character like with Trip or Alon, people would not be happy. However, if he constantly is the focus as this unbeatable trainer, then eventually his story will become dull. Sure, he restarts and uses a different team apart from Pikachu, but that still hasn't been an excuse for most people. But Electro, One Punch Man wins every fight and his story isn't boring. Even though this is true, that doesn't really change anything for Ash. One Punch Man winning every fight is the main punchline of the series. He's essentially the protagonist from the end of a series, plucked from that point and put at the beginning of the series. That doesn't really work for Ash here. Now, between these ideas, Ash seeking out legendaries would be a way to have him lose while not being problematic, as it wouldn't disrupt his new status as world champion, and legendary Pokemon are supposed to be stronger anyway. You could also give the argument that Ash would want to become friends with more Pokemon, and him meeting all the legendaries would help with this. But there's a problem with that as well. He's met pretty much every legendary already, and when it comes to Ash meeting legendaries, fans want Ash to do it solely so he can catch them. But that's not his goal. And we don't know if catching legendaries would really help Ash become a Pokemon master or not. So, this is something that I feel would not work out in the end, even if it would be cool to see. Now, let's say they were to continue forward with Ash as a protagonist. This would mean we would not get the mini-series about him becoming a Pokemon Master. On one hand, fans might be fine with this, because Ash is continuing his journey. However, this could still be problematic. If Ash continuing his journey goes on forever, he'll never become a Pokemon Master. This could be taken as some dreams just are unreachable, which isn't really a good thing to tell children. On the other hand, Ash would be a trainer who never gives up, and would be seen as such. But that's been his morals for the past 25 years. You would just be adding on the fact that he would never become a Pokemon Master. Now, there are other ways Ash could be involved. Many people have suggested ideas due to the fact that they don't want Ash to be completely gone. He could play a role like Brock, and be a sort of mentor to the new characters. This isn't a bad idea, but if you want to see Ash grow as a character, he wouldn't have any kind of goal, and would just be there to train the next generation. Fans also th think that Ash could be the father of the new main character, Rico. Or... Liko? 
not sure which exactly. That's really a topic for another time, however. It's easy to have this concept go wrong. Don't believe me? Well, look at Boruto. How's that going for the Naruto fanbase? Now, does this mean Ash can't be in the series at all? Not necessarily. Personally, I believe Ash should be the main goal of the new protagonists. Giving him a role like Leon had in Journeys, but for more than just a season-long adventure, is a very respectable way to bring Ash back. Not only that, but being a mentor could still work. It just doesn't work for everyone. Still, it might be best that Ash leave for good. He's reaching his goal and there's not really much left for him to do. We've had him for 25 years and maybe the best thing for the Pokemon franchise is a fresh start. Rico and Roy look promising to me, and they could possibly continue on for a long time. While it's unfortunate Ash is leaving after this long, a lot of other series have done the same and still found success. Take a look at Beyblade and Yu-Gi-Oh. Regardless, wherever the anime chooses to go from here, it should be interesting. I, for one, am looking forward to the future, and I hope you are as well. But, if you disagree, you can let me know in the comments below. However, I do ask that you at least be civil in letting me know your opinion. With that being said, thank you all for watching, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye! Real quick before you guys leave, thank you all for watching. This is a type of video I haven't really done before, and I'm giving it a shot, so let me know if you want to see more things like this. This is also my first video using my brand new microphone, so hopefully this is coming through well and with a lot better audio quality than my previous videos. Anyways, yeah, I just wanted to take the time to thank you all for watching. I'm going to be making some more one-off videos here and there, or at least I'm going to be trying to. And I just want to see if you guys enjoy that kind of thing. So while also telling me your thoughts on the topic at hand, please let me know down in the comments below if you want to see more stuff like this. Thanks. See you guys in the next one. Bye!